Pressure in liquids increases with depth. Now, does pressure really increase with depth? Well, that's a question we want to prove in this video. So in this video, we're going to show that pressure in liquids indeed increases with depth. This is Kisembo Academy, and thanks for tuning in. But before we go into that experiment, let's try and verify it mathematically. We have a question right here. It's telling us that uh, this is a liquid column. This could be water. Yes, this is water. This is a liquid column. It is water with points A, B, and C. And we are required to calculate the pressure at the point in this liquid column or in this quarter quarter, in this water column at 5 meters, which is from here to there. That is at point C. Then at 10 meters, which is uh, at that point. This is point B. Then at point A, which is 15 meters. So let's try and find the pressure at all these three points a b and c now the pressure at point a is going to be equal to height times density times gravity now the height at point a is 15 meters multiply that by the density now we know the density of water is a thousand kilograms per meters cubed it is a constant so it's a thousand kilograms per meters cubed Multiply that by gravity. Our gravity is also a constant, which is 10. And so our answer here is 150,000 newtons per meter uh, squared. This is also in Pascals. Let's look at pressure at point B. And now we know that point B is 10 meters from the surface of the water. Now what pressure is being exerted at that point? Pressure at point B is still high times density times gravity. We know that the height is 10 meters. Multiply that by density. Density of water is 1,000 times gravity, which is 10. And we shall end up with 100,000 newtons per meter squared. And then also pressure at point C is going to be... Now we know that point C is 5 meters from the top. So it's going to be uh, 5 height times density, which is... 1,000 times gravity, which is 10, and we shall end up with 50,000 newtons per meter squared. Now, if you look at all these three answers, you realize that when the height was very high, 15 meters, the pressure we got was very high. And as we went on reducing the height to 10 to 5, you realize that the pressures also kept reducing. So mathematically, you find that according to our calculations, indeed, it is true that pressure in liquids will increase with depth. It means that the higher the length, or the, I mean the higher the height, or the deeper the water, the higher the pressure. Now, let us verify this experimentally. Now, according to our experiment, if you are to represent that experiment diagrammatically, we got a water can, we put water there, and we pinched three holes. This is hole A, hole B, hole C. And according to the results of our experiment, we realized that the hole that was at the very bottom uh, pushed water out th uh, through a longer distance. Then the one in B pushed water to that distance. Then the one at C pushed water at that distance. Now, this pressure that is coming out of here was able to push it very far through a very long distance because at this point, the, 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 the depth of this water or the height is... Is, is, is higher or is more than at point C. At point C, the pressure coming out is low, so the, this liquid coming out cannot go very far. It can only come at that point. So now this experiment simply verifies or it simply proves that it is indeed true that pressure in liquids increases with depth. Now this explains why at when they are constructing the dam. When they are constructing power dam, the base is thicker. The base of these dams is thicker, but as you go up the construction, uh, the dams are narrower. This is because they create a provision for the, the, the bases of these dams are supposed to be, are constructed to be thick because they are supposed to be constructed in such a way that they withstand the pressure of the water because it increases with depth.
This brings us to the end of this video. Thanks for watching. For more of this video, simply subscribe. And please remember to share this video. For Kisembo Academy, this is Anodranga Kuramia.